BJ from Hearst Hobbies and I'm going to be talking today about this magical stuff called looks like glass. So looks like glass is a water-based clear uh, and it's designed to work like uh, a lot of people used to use floor polish for dipping their clear parts to make them look uh, more crisp. So uh, floor polish have been very hard to come by. So the stuff that used to work very well was the stuff you get from the States. Uh, it was Pledge, I think it changed many, many different names, um, but you can't find it really. But Deluxe from England have brought out this particular um, product. It's in a small size, so it's a bit, bit uh, easier to use, uh, easier to brush, can be airbrushed. And I'll give you a quick demonstration of what I've done on this bit of clear here. Now I've just used some of these gold hand sanding sponges and I've scratched up the surface on the curved surface and also the flat surface. So I'll just bring that in here and with a sharp side light, you'll probably have a, a better impression of seeing it. So what I've done here is on the flat section, the, the lower part has been sanded with 400 grit, and then the middle part has been sanded with 1000 grit, and the top part has been sanded with 6000 grit. I've done exactly the same order across this curved area, and then I've just brush painted this looks like glass over the top. And you can see the difference between the halves here, how different that already looks. So it's already brought up the gloss, and you can see that the 400, you can still see the scratches, but it's made it much glossier. The 1000 is still noticeable, but the 6000 is almost perfectly clear. And that's how good this particular gloss works. Now it's a very slow drying material. Um, allow a couple of hours, uh, to dry. Now, this has just been brush painted on one surface. Now, if we dip that, that would have coated both surfaces and would have made it look much clearer again. So this side here, you can see this was as polished from the factory with looks like glass on it. And you can see how transparent it looks compared to this side, which is straight from the factory. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to use a bit of 6000 grit paper just to give you an impression of how easy it is. So I use the 6000 which is the final one I've been using and I'll give it a quick polish and then we'll go over. So you'll see all those sanding marks going through. So that's actually sanding the earlier coating of the looks like glass as well. But I'll do the front here. Let's go over the 400 as well. Try and get it as smooth as I can. I probably need a bit more time. All right. Okay. That should do it for the demo. I think give you a good idea of what it's going to look like. So I just quickly rub that back, and you see how it's all frosted up. It's frosted up all around there. Now I'm just going to pop this down here for a second. Open the bottle. Now the bottle's childproof, so you have to press it down and spin it. Okay, like so. Let's get my brush here. So it's as easy as just dipping it in. Let's get there. You can see how liquid it is. It's very thin. Like so. Alright, I'm going to pick up my bit of canopy. Now obviously if you want a really smooth finish, you just dip it and you place it somewhere to dry. Now, brush is pretty good, but for larger areas, it'll probably work better with airbrush. Now this stuff here, you can thin it down with a touch of water. Okay, just like so. And you put it on really heavy, if you like. And this is all going to self-level. So I'll do this, do this. Now that's still wet and it's going to clear up um, when it dries further. But that gives you an impression of how quick it is to apply. And you give it a bit of time and it'll self level again. But you can already see the gloss. So it looks very wet now and when it dries, it's still going to have that wet look. So there you go. Let's. Um, Looks like glass, very easy to use. Uh, you could dip it, so the, the cap is pretty large already, so you could easily dip 48 scale uh, jet 
or even a fighter type um, canopies or even smaller, they'll go straight in, pull them straight out, hang them up, let them dry, and they'll look very clear. It increases the clarity, makes them look thinner, so it looks more scale, um, and gives the overall detail a, a much better look. So imagine greater uh, clarity going through small canopies, you'll be able to see all the cockpit details as well. So there you go. Thank you for watching.